grand risings my love bugs my lions and lioness how y'all doing um i got some great news finally got some great news i finally moved guys i yes we did it right we fucking did it bitch the ancestors my spirit guy my spirit team i hear Yes, we fucking did it, bitch. We manifested that good old motherfucking change that we wanted so bad. And we got it. We got it, baby. It's a beautiful, it's a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful bless up. You understand? It's beautiful, baby. And um, I just want to give thanks right now. Yo. I don't want to start crying because this is not the real video, all right? I'm just doing this right now. This is not the real video. I'm going to make a real, 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 real video about this, all right? Because this is real life shit. Big up, yo, big up, say expedite. I got to work with him again because I'm having a situation right now. And I need to work with him, you know, with this other situation. But overall... You know, we, we got through, we got through. We just we just gotta, you know, finish up the process, but um I mean complete the process, but we, we it's finished, but we gotta complete it, alright? So um big up big up these yo, big up these deities, Saint Expedite, Saint Martha, yo Big up Oshun, big up um Oya, big up Obatala, big up Papa Legba issue Big up, um, Sajon. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. There's so many of them, baby. It's so, but it's only a few I work with, so that's what we're bigging up right now. I gotta make a delivery, guys. So, we're there, pun. The post office. Okay, so, um, because you know I'm too loud, I can't be in there. So, um, yo, yes, pick up these, these, those is the deities that I work with, that I have been working with. Oh, big up Madame, big up Mama Madame, can't forget her, the La Madamas, big up La Madama, can't forget, yo, big up those deities, those all the deities I've been working with, those all the deities I show love to. Uh, I give offerings to big them up. Um, I have not, you know, it's kind of reminded me of my old place when I was taking time to work with them and stuff like that because I just moved. I still got shit in my boxes. I have not taken them out and put them on a altar yet. And, you know, and I want to I want to celebrate to them. I want to thank them. I want to put out, you know, the, some offerings, some candles. I just don't want to put them out there. I want to give them what they need and I need to work with them some more. But I want to take out all my stuff out of my boxes first. You understand? And then I want to set it up because I need to continue to work with them. It's not over. It's not finished. You don't get what the fuck you want and start working with them, bitch. I'm going to be working with them until until my last fucking breath I'm working with them. Okay? Because they've been helping me a whole fucking lot. Nobody else. Okay? Nobody physically else. These deities been helping me. Nobody in a physical room. All right. And um, I just want to give thanks. They work. Say expedite. Thank you. Give him his fucking public announcements. Public shout out. All right. His um his um pound cake and his his cross. Okay. I gave him that. I got, I'm gonna give it to him again. All right, guys. And um. Okay, yeah, so that's that, <laughs> all right? I just want to put that out there. I'm thankful I have moved. I'm going to start back on my, um, you know, doing my work and my, my readers and things like that. But, um, you know, right now I'm still I'm still unpacking and stuff like that. Somebody stole some my shit. This guy, one of the pack, the movers stole, you know, my, my, you know, my two jackets, my sneakers. You know, they stole from me and and that's fucked up because I've been doing good. Okay, I haven't I haven't stolen any
body things, okay? I haven't, um, I haven't, you know, if I find something, I return it. I haven't, I haven't been in a situation where, you understand, that, that, you know, I haven't been in a situation where that shit happened to me. You know, I, people still, uh, from other people and people still back from them, that's karma. But I haven't done that. I have been just fo focusing on moving, getting back to work, talking my shit, and learning and growing. You understand? So I don't know why would somebody want to do that to me. I'm a good, you know, a good person. And I, I became a good person. I used to be kind of fucked up, but, all right? But I made a, a big fucking change. So I don't know why he did that, but it's going to come 10 times fold back to his motherfucking ass because I'm one of the chosen ones and you don't fuck with one of the chosen ones. So his days, his, his, his last days is near. His last days is near, right? He might get hit by a fucking trailer fucking tractor, bitch. I don't give a fuck about that man. All right? I hope he get fucking hit by a whole fucking truck. And, a, and another truck run over his fucking ass and then he fucking blow up, bitch. Stealing my shit. All right? But that's that. I don't want to keep talking about it because it's going to get me aggravated, man. So, you don't fuck with people, especially the chosen ones. The ancestors already got some shit for that ass. His ass is going to burn up. All right? So, anyway, um, other than that, um, my divine masculine, guys, that's another story. I know it's always something with my with this fucking divine masculine, right? With my divine masculine. So right now I'm I'm mad at him again. <laughs> I'm mad at him again. He was supposed to go out with me for my birthday and he didn't, guys. He was supposed to. I made made reservations. Made reservations. Okay. I'm not that mad because um I'm not that mad because um I found out that day I was supposed to go out to eat i found out that my shit was stolen okay so i wasn't really up you know i wasn't really up for um to be going out and stuff you know because um i wasn't feeling a vibe after i found out that you know i couldn't my out fucked up my outfit i can't even fucking find out the shoot guys i don't even know like that's like something good happened and something bad happened to me you understand i'm like damn why the fuck i just i couldn't just have all my shit like why the fuck does that have to happen you understand at least if he stole my shit, look, I got one pair of fucking shoe. At least I have two shoes. They stole my, I could buy it again. But at least, listen, I don't want to talk about it. My, one of my favorite fucking shoes, I can't find it. Because these shoes is no name, bitch. And it's hard. And I'm so fucking mad I can't find this. All right, but we're going to try to find this still. <laughs> anyway, so, yeah. So, it fucked up the vibe. I ain't want to go out no more. So, but still, bitch, like, you could have fucking called and said, oh, I can't make it something. He didn't do that. I cursed him out, bitch. I cursed his fucking stupid ass out. I said, you stupid motherfucker. You always want to beat your friends. You need to get your shit together. You stupid motherfucker. Because he is stupid. You fucking stupid bitch. All right? He being stupid. He not really stupid guy. All right? And I'm just like, damn, this fucking man. I'm like, I love this man so fucking much. I know this man loved me. You understand? Like, I know that a thousand and one motherfucking percent, bitch. Before I could never say this shit, right? Before I could never say this shit. But he got some fucked up ways, but this man does love me, okay? Like, he really do love me, guys. I can't even, all right? I talk about, I talk, I talk my shit. I talk about our shit, but I don't really get too, too, too personal because, you know, and, and deep because that's personal information, you understand, between me and him. But this man has done things, all right, with me, to me, that no other man have ever done. No other man, bitch. No other man. Not even my baby father, okay? So that's how I know what the fuck I know, all right? The shit that he motherfucking that we be doing okay <laughs> right so no other guy is gonna fucking be doing that no other guy is gonna be doing that unless they they really 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 fucking in love with you or no guy you understand like listen bitch it took him years to even get to this fucking point so uh, listen all right i know he loved me but i'm like okay damn nigga you show me you understand that you love me in so many ways. You understand, like, this nigga saying love songs. <laughs> he saying love songs to me. We, yo, it's, yo, we had, it was so beautiful, bitch. I can't, y'all don't even, I said it on my other video. Watch my other video, bitch. Like, we had a mag magical motherfucking moment. 
and that wasn't the first time but that was the first time like we had like we're singing but that's not all right whatever <laughs> so i know this man loved me right i'm like damn bitch i know you love me you understand like but you need to get it together like he come see me come spend time but like we still didn't go out oh, bitch i want to fucking go somewhere and we come over bitch we going out and uh -uh. Bitch, we going out here, fuck if it's up the street to go get some food and drinks, bitch, let's go. Let's fucking go, ho. Cause he pissing me off. All right, what the fuck is going on, bitch? I wanna go on a date. We didn't go on nobody fucking date yet, bitch. That would have been our first date. All right? So, um, we gonna go on a date and I'm gonna let him know we gotta go out, or and if you know, if you're not ready and you wanna continue to fuck off and go fucking play with your friends, then don't come back until you're ready, bitch. I'm so serious. I'm so serious. And y'all, bitch, I talk to my divine masculine. It's not like I don't talk to them, bitch. I talk to them, but you know what? I think I need to really, really, really be stern and talk to them. Because I do talk to them, like, yo, what the fuck? Like, what's your. But no, this time, for real, because I can't. Like, come, I just move. I'm not doing this at the new house, bitch. Nobody's not doing this. Back and forth, in and out. Eh, uh -uh, bitch, because I moved, and I might get a whole new man over here. Even, like, even though nobody is not going to compare to my divine masculine, bitch. Nobody, bitch. Okay? Because I'm like, even if they do, you understand, spend time with me, even if they do, you know, we go out and he take me out, you know, that guy. I mean, I'm going to like it, but I'm going to wish that it was with my Divine Masculine. You understand what I'm saying? Like, you know, everything I want from my Divine Masculine, I might get it from somebody else, you know, because he's not ready or whatever. You know, this guy might take me out. He might be calling me all the time. He might want to pick me up, go out, spend time with me. That's going to be nice, and I'm going to, you understand? Unless I'm feeling, you know, really feeling him like that. But I'm my divine masculine is always going to be in my head. He's always going to be on my mind. I'm always going to be thinking, like, damn, I want this to be my divine masculine. Why well, this can't be my divine masculine? Like, I want, you understand, this should not be another man. This should be my, me and my masculine. You understand? But um, uh, only time will tell, guys, because I don't know. It's like, and then it's like. He acting stupid, right? And then when I wanna, and I was listening to my reading last night, and they were saying how when you wanna move on from your divine masculine, um, that you always like all signs and synchronicities always popping up, and I said that shit is so fucking true. When I'm fucking done with him, when I be like, oh, I'm fucking moving on, you fucking stupid bitch, fuck you, and everything you fucking carry with you, you understand? It's fucking exactly. It's like something. His spirit stops me or you understand like it don't want me to date nobody else it don't want me to be with nobody else but he want to fucking you understand come in and out he want to fucking you know talk to me when it's convenient for him and I told him this I cursed him out bitch I fucking listen he ain't nobody's playing with him and he's he's not leaving me and but he need, he need but he need to do better bitch or he gonna get left he not leaving me, but I ain't fucking say he ain't get, he wouldn't get left. Because I got to leave him so he can know I'm serious, bitch. What the fuck is going on? You never come around with my hair done. No. <laughs> when the pop in, I mean, he do, but not when I be having, like, the pop in. I was like, what the fuck is going on, bitch? You want to come around when I'm looking all fucked up and shit? He don't fuck the business. He still love me. But I want you to be around me when I'm looking fabulous. <laughs> You know, so even if, you know, you was to get another man, that man, you still going to be thinking about your divine mess. It's not like they could take their place. Nobody can't take that motherfucking place, bitch. And then since he, and since it's getting more intense and deeper, since it's getting more, it's like, bitch, the more and more deeper you get, the more and more you don't want to be with nobody else. Oh, yeah, I've been here. My, that's why my bike was here. So, I don't know what time. I'm standing right out.
outside. I don't know if you can see me outside. I'm standing right there. All right, guys, I'm in the post office right now.